What's up, ballers? It's Bobby Buckets here with my very first episode of Madden Mobile 17. So in today's episode, I'm going to be showing you guys how I made 400,000 coins in one day. There's no cheating, no bots. This is all easy sniping filters. Um, I'm actually kind of surprised I was able to make this many coins. And this isn't like everything that I have either. If you go and look at my team and you look at my items and look at all these players that I have, these are all the guys that I had listed that didn't even sell. So I still have to sell all those guys probably at least uh, between 50 and 70k worth of items. So if you add those guys in, I've probably made about 450,000 coins at least. And I just started playing the game yesterday. So I'm just going to show you guys some real simple filters. Really, all that I did when I was doing this, I would set the filter. You know that for sniping in Mad Mobile, the, um, the new players that come in refresh every... I found that it's either every 5 minutes and 5 seconds or 5 minutes and 10 seconds. But basically, I'll either read a book while I'm doing this or do something else so I don't get bored. Um, the filter that I use is 72 to 74, and I also varied it a little bit, so um, it depends on the time of day. Whenever it gets to a busier time of day, I set it to 73 to 74. Price, by now, 1,000. Oh, that's 100. 1,000, and position, pretty much everything except for tight ends and defensive ends, because uh, they sell for significantly less. And pretty much any type, there's nothing particular that we're looking for. So you see, for this one, there's not a ton of players. Um, so it depends partially on the time of day. I actually currently don't know what time the filter resets. Um, so in a busier time of day, this one works really well. When it's not as busy, I do 72 to 74, which opens up a lot. So right now, that's not going to be a great option because players aren't selling for as much. Uh, so earlier today, I was buying these 72s, and I could resell all of them for at least 2,000 coins. So that's an instant, uh, including tax, that's instant 800 coins profit. And I would snipe like probably between 10 and 12 in a round. Um, and it wasn't just the 1,000 coins one, coin ones. Like right there, if you have an 800 coin one, um, just go ahead and buy that because all of these will resell for 2,000. For me, probably 80% of my players sold. So I'm not going to promise you they're all going to sell immediately for 2,000. But if you sell them for two rounds, especially at a less busy time, they're guaranteed to sell for 2,000. So if any 72 that is 800 coins and below, go ahead and grab. Um, but this is my favorite one, 73 to 74. Um, Mainly because anybody 73 and above will sell for 2,500. Anybody 74 and above will sell for 3,000. So if you can get a 74 for 1,000 coins, that's instant 2,000 coins profit. And so you're looking at these and thinking these don't look like incredibly profitable filters. The thing you have to take into account is whenever I'm doing this, I'm getting a ton of players at one time. So usually the lowest number of players that I'll be able to grab is probably like five or six players. So if you think one round, if I get half of those are 73s, a couple 72s, and a couple 74s, that's almost 10,000 coins profit in just five minutes. So as you can see, that's definitely added up over the past day. Uh, I've been just been doing this either when I was bored, so either maybe I'll be watching a video... Um, and just be, make sure you know whenever the filters are going to refresh. Uh, so you don't really have to waste a lot of time because you can just come back to it whenever you know it's going to happen. So I've probably only spent maybe two or three hours on this. Uh, it's really simple to do. I even still have auctions up from when I was doing it earlier. So I still have more coins to be made. Uh, really hoping that we can get this on screen just so you guys can get an example of how well this works. And like I said, you can mess around with it to how you like. Some people might take out safeties. I believe safeties also don't sell for quite as much. 
but pretty much everybody else is almost a guaranteed sell. Uh, definitely wide receivers and running backs are a guaranteed sell. Quarterbacks, if you can get them, will actually sell for a ton more. I think a 72 quarterback right now is around 6,000 coins. Same for uh, punters. I think punters are around 12,000 for a 72. I grabbed one of them earlier. There we go. That's one snipe. Oh, all right. Uh, refresh. Scroll to the side. Okay, so we only got one on there. It's definitely a busier time of day. Uh, but that right there, 74, uh, he's going to resell for 3,000 coins at least. So right there, I just made 2,500 coins profit. It's very simple to do, especially when it's not a busy time of day. But yeah, that's basically what I've been doing uh, to make my coins recently. So let me know what you guys think. I don't think that there's a ton of people using this filter. Uh, I don't even know if there's many bots using this filter because it seemed like there were some rounds when I was able to get like 10 to 12 snipes in one round. So it's been really useful for me. Hope you guys enjoyed the episode. Let me know if you want me to upload some more Madden Mobile content, but please be sure to comment, like, and subscribe if you guys enjoyed, and I will see you guys next time.